Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Maritzel and if you're new here, uh, hello, what's up and welcome to my channel. I haven't done a video in a long time. Uh, but today I am going to talk about my uh, August uh, wrap up of the books that I have read for August and I'm going to uh, show you my TBR for September and I hope you enjoy this video. Okay, so the first book that I'm going to show you guys is uh, No Angel. I picked it up at a like book thrift store and I actually really liked it. Like I didn't think I was going to like it as much as I did. It was kind of like a funny like comedy book. I don't know if it was intended to be like that, but I thought it was really funny. I really liked reading the book though. It was really like um, interesting and like the, t the, the whole take on like like the like religion kind of stuff was interesting to me this book is about a boy named uh rafael angelos and he basically uh moves now he like moves and he also goes to this new school as uh, that was originally only for girls but he's the only boy that they lit in the school and basically he has to uh be like guardian angel to all the girls there and there's so many twists in this book um but it's really good excuse me for the lighting change i like for like the first what like five minutes of this video i forgot to turn on my uh ring light so sorry about that but uh now that we <laughs> i have that fixed the next book that i'm gonna talk about is my second book of august uh that i read and it's the night circus i um I'm kind of disappointed by this book like I wanted to love it so bad like it was so hyped up on TikTok like I just wanted to love it like I just wanted it to be like a five-star read but it wasn't it was okay I give it like three uh, and a half stars out of five I hated the ending like I just could not stand the ending at all um also excuse my nails by the way they're in the process of being taken off but uh yes this book very disappointed I, it's really well written like everything about it is good like it's not a bad book um the story is really immersive the way that everything is written it's like you're like in the story like you're part of the story like you're involved into the book like you just want to love this book so bad but like the ending is just so i don't know like you just gotta read it for yourself and decide for yourself but for me this book's a three and a half stars out of five so the next book that i read was shadow and bone and i read it because it was all over tiktok and i was just like oh i have to read it like everybody talked so good about this book and you know what this book is worth the hype i am in love with this series already like i read this book kid you not in like three days like it was just so good like i don't have time to read like all day because i have a kid but like i read the book so fast because it was so good like this book was just like I could not stop reading like like it's just uh, I love it so much and um I also like read the second book and oh uh, okay so I love the first book way more but uh I love this book so much and it's mainly because of one single character that made this book so good like I just I fell in love with the character like I just found out with the character like I just love this book so much just because of that character like he's like uh, amazing like everything about him is so like ah uh, like I don't know how to explain it like I just love him like he's so funny he's like I don't know like it, he's charming like I don't know like I just love that character so much but yes that is basically all the books that I was able to read in August this book took up like most of my time reading it because i just didn't want to finish it like it was just uh but anyways i am going to continue with my tbr for september and i already started this book the third book in the series um i'm like 100 pages in 
I obviously I'm gonna finish this book in September so I love it so far and then I'm gonna read the six of crows um, I'm planning on reading all of the books before I watch the show like I really like I'm just like anticipating the show like I feel like the books are so good like I just want to watch the show just so I could see everything that I read like come to life like uh, I just love these books so much so hopefully this book is good um it seems good like I've read I've read it not I've read it like I've read so many reviews of the book and so many people hyped up this book too also on book talk and on tiktok so I hope that it's good sorry I like I started reading like the Thing. but anyway i'll read you guys the synopsis for the book a bustling hub of international trade where anything can be had sorry i'm reading to you guys like if you're my son uh, <laughs> a bustling hub of international trade where anything can be had for the right price and no one knows that better than criminal prodigy prodigy kaz becker kaz is offered a chance at a deadly heist that could make him rich beyond his wildest dreams but he can't pull it off alone like that just seems like a really interesting plot hopefully it's good and it's worth the hype like the other books were um i so far love the way that this author writes like it's really immersive like i just love the way that she writes um but yeah so hopefully i like this book as much as i like the other ones and then after that after, I, after i'm done with the series basically i'm gonna start reading the percy jackson books so yeah so i'm gonna read percy jackson and the lightning thing thing thief percy jackson and the lightning thief i'm gonna read this one next um after six of crows i have been wanting to read the series for a long time um ever since the sense i saw the first movie i was like oh i just need to like watch not watch i just need to read the books so bad and finally i got the books the all of them for my birthday so i'm gonna read all of the books so i'm gonna read this one and then after that one i'm gonna read this one so hopefully i can actually uh read all of these i only have four in my tbr just in case because i only started reading books again like in july or june yeah in june um i used to love reading but i stopped reading like uh because i got lazy but i started reading again so i hopefully i can get used to reading again and just like speed up how fast i read books but um so far my tbr only have these four books but i don't know how fast i'll finish these up i mean i feel like i'll finish these pretty fast i mean they're like really small anyway so i'll probably just end up finishing the whole series if i if i can um if not i'll just finish it in october or november because there's like i think like three more books so yeah those are the books in my tbr for september anyway uh thank you so much for watching my august wrap up and my september tbr i hope you enjoyed this video hopefully it wasn't too long hopefully i think it's like pretty short actually um but yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you have a good rest of your day or night and see you next time uh please like and subscribe Till next time, bye guys.